What's up, it's your girl Raven, the blazing Eurasia representing Brooklyn Bodega Radio, BrooklynBodega.com, and the Brooklyn Hip Hop Festival. I'm here with Vic Black, the owner of Sputnik. Okay. We just came out of the like most ridiculous, hottest, Quilly sure. performance, style showed up, Primo's still rocking. Now, I want to know, I mean, you're here smiling, you, you know what, what, what you got going on. A lot of energy, but you got the true essence of hip hop. And I want you to tell me a little bit about when you decide who you want to rock with, but what, what goes through your mind? Well, basically what goes through my mind is like, you know, I've been in the game for a long time. I've been in the game for a long time, so I do know, you know, what real hip hop is. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's like, like a dream, you know what I'm saying? You, you go to sleep, and while I'm sleeping, I'm dreaming about, you know, who I want to bring in here because the element of the game has changed a lot. So, I want to try to bring true hip hop. And the ones that I can get, because the schedules are really conflicting, I haven't even touched half the people, but I've right. got a lot of people. Uh, yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, it's just a natural thing, you know what I'm right. saying, that I do, you know, only because, like, I'm true to the game. I've been right. in the game. Very long time ago, so all about so, right? You told about this yesterday. Eons, yeah. yeah. So I'm a gangsta native, and um, yeah. I'm happy you know, that I'm able to give a platform to not only the ones that are out there that paved the way, right. but you know, for ones that are up and coming. Right. R&B, world music. You notice that, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I try to do a different kind of food. The last night was different. Right. Because it was a ladies night I created. And what I did with that, with two, is just add, you know, just artists, different artists. Like it was a rock, you know, and mm -hmm. everybody's like, you know, but she was dope. You right. know, and they can't front and say she wasn't dope. Right. Because she was. Right. Rock is a part of hip-hop. Right. You know what I'm saying? So just adding true elements to the game. And then, you know, like, I'm on the phone beating it up to see who I can get. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, 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 right. I can't do it right now, but, right. you know, yo, I got you, you know. And right. then just keep following them, following right. up, you know what I'm saying? And you notice that it's just mad love. Like, you know, a lot of times people oh, yeah, think yeah, yeah, you gotta go to these bigger media yeah. and performance, but we actually prefer the more, you know, I mean, we think about, you know, old school trance, right. 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 you know, that's the kind of feel that we have. It's the essence, man, you know what right. I'm saying? Like, it may be a super, super hot in there, right. but people, you know, that's what, that's what hip hop before the air conditions we were in. Right. The projects, right. <laughs> you know what I'm right. saying? There was no air conditioning, right. we were sweating anyway, so, you know. <laughs> Good. Nobody's like, I think nobody really has any complaint. You know, no, so not at all. Here, you know what I'm saying? I'm just glad that people came out and enjoyed yeah. what I offered. You know, and yeah. you know, the good time live probably in Brooklyn together yeah. here. I and know. then we had Stella with Styles P hit the stage, Jean Grey, oh, you know, yeah. and then a, a girl from South Carolina, Khaled, you know, right. and she's like, uh, and we had Abby Dobson who sings behind uh, right. Tyler. Right. So everything, like, to me, fell in right in place. Right. Right. It just right. fell right in place. Right. And, 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 and just the whole vibe was good. You know, right. that's really important to me. You know right. what I'm saying? It was the love, the vibe, you know? Whether it was R&B, whether it was rock, whether it was just like the about love, and all the groups unifying. That's what I wanted. I wanted all the groups unifying to see each other. You know what I'm saying? Right. And right. just come together and do it. And you might better use the artist to do something. This exactly. Do something. And they just show up. Like, we keep talking about how last night Pharaoh came through right. just to scope it out. Right. You know, MC Light was here watching all the female MCs just right. to see, okay, who's the challenge? You know, so I gotta say thank you, like, literally, yeah. for having a point like this. Because me as a true hip hop head myself, it's like, you always seek in the spot where, like, I, I just want to go and sweat and just watch Quelly. I don't want to be, like, you know, right. number 750, right. whatever, paying What's stuff. For that? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? This is, this is true essence. You know, as we say, it's not only about the MCs and the DJs, it's about the people who actually are behind, you know, these venues, putting it out for us to view. So once again, we got, we got Big Black doing his thing. Yeah, I was here last night. I'm gonna keep coming, you know. Keep, Please. I, I, eat what, you want, you I eat burgers. I come downstairs. Yeah, and, uh, a, and if you wanna do something here, the platform is there. Let's do it. We'll do it. Brooklyn Hip Hop Festival after party. I don't know. Maybe we talk about it. You know what I mean? Shout out to Brooklyn Hip Hop Festival. The show will be black. Thanks, all forever. You heard? There you go. You go, Raven. We out. Peace. All right.